If I told you you had to fail today to succeed tomorrow, some people would disagree. Some people would feel excited, some people would feel motivated, and other people would have a sense of anxiety and stress. And that is why failure needs to be at the foundation of every training program. If you introduce failure into your athletes' training programs, then you are allowing them to cultivate and improve the key psychological characteristics of excellence. You're also allowing your players to train in an optimal challenge point where they learn to persevere through adversity, where they learn how to handle failures, shortcomings, and they use them as motivation to be the catalyst to their future success. So when you're building a training program, it's extremely important to have tasks, to have challenges, and to have them in a performance environment that forces them to fail, forces them to want to come out the next day and succeed, forces them to prove that they can do it. Because ultimately, when you're standing on the 16th or 17th hole and you have to make birdie to win a golf tournament, you are going to revert back to what you did in training. And if you've trained to persevere in a stressful environment, then you ultimately will be able to call back on those training experiences and apply them inside of the competitive arena. But failure doesn't just come with performance. Failure also comes with technique. If you're only working on your swing and you're given a training aid that allows you to do it correctly every single time, you're actually not learning. You're learning when you take one of those learning trials and you do it wrong and you get feedback and then you have to adjust and then you do it again and you get feedback and you have to adjust. So remember, failure isn't just associated with how you perform. Failure is associated with how you learn. And ultimately in golf, you're trying to learn how to shoot a lower score and go from good to great. So if you want to truly evolve your golf, make sure that your training environment has stress, has realistic experiences that would cause you to feel stressed, and that you have to persevere through.